New at 6 tonight, the Roman Catholic Diocese of Fresno is ready to bring in a new bishop. This after the current bishop, Armando Ochoa, announced his retirement. Bishop Joseph Brennan will step into the role in May. CBS 47's Pedro Quintana is live at St. John's Cathedral in downtown Fresno. And Pedro, the new bishop is calling for immediate transparency. Catherine, that is correct. Now, now, according to the Catholic Diocese here in Fresno, they have started reviewing the clergy files of local priests who are accused of sex crimes. Now, Bishop Joseph Brennan says the diocese will continue to conduct those investigations. He'll bring transparency once he's installed this May. God. I'm thrilled to. After being at the forefront of the Catholic Diocese of Fresno for over seven years, Bishop Armando Ochoa announced he'll be retiring in two months. Ochoa submitted his letter of retirement to the Vatican in April of last year. After seven wonderful years as your bishop, I know that the clergy, the religious men and women, and all God's people will welcome Bishop Brennan with open arms and open hearts. Brennan was appointed to auxiliary bishop to the Archdiocese of Los Angeles in 2015 and has been serving in the Southern California area. To inspire in everyone I work with here at the Chancery, everyone I will meet every single day. In February, Bishop Ochoa stated the Diocese of Fresno were reviewing clergy files which dated back to 1922. Earlier this week, the Diocese of Fresno put priest Miguel Flores on paid administrative leave as he faces allegations of sexual abuse that took place in 2002. That particular one is going to be an internal investigation. We received a credible uh, allegation that dates back to many years ago and so we are re-looking at that particular one right now. The Diocese of Fresno says four priests have been put on paid administrative leave. Only two are facing allegations of abuse to a minor. We have to work. We just have to work at transparency. We have to work at, at always reaching out to the victims. And Bishop Joseph Brennan will take position of the diocese on May 1st, the same time the diocese could be releasing information on those accused priests. For now, we're live here in downtown Fresno, Pedro Quintana, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.